Thanks for taking a few minutes to find out about the PAM Train the Trainer course. My name is Dr. Ollie Hart. I'm one, one of the clinical directors at Peak Health Coaching. This course is aimed at people who want to learn how to teach their colleagues how to get the best out of the patient activation measure. You will usually have been on our Putting PAM into Practice course already and had some experience of using PAM in your everyday working life. In our experience, learning to teach your colleagues and building that capacity for uh, using the PAM locally is a great way of sustaining personalised care approaches in your organisation. But not only that, for you, it will help you to grow your confidence as, um, as a trainer and teaching other people, and it will help you to become a champion for personalised care approaches across the system. Hello, I'm Caroline Hart. I'm the Education Director here at Peak Health Coaching. And I just wanted to tell you a little bit about the format of our two-day Train the Trainer course for PAM, the Patient Activation Measure. So it's a two-day online course. We start you off with some pre-course materials to familiarise yourself with before arriving at uh, day one online in our virtual learning environment. Um, we're very used to training in this way and you'll have a chance to meet your online peer trainers. During that day, we'll re-familiarise ourselves with the half-day PAM training course, which you can learn about elsewhere on our website. And in the afternoon, we look at a range of training, um, facilitation and pre presentation skills giving you a chance to reflect on the skills that you're bringing to our course, as well as looking to develop those skills further. Between day one and two, you get a chance to go away, do a little bit of preparation with one or more peer trainers, so that when you come back on day two, you will have an opportunity to begin to deliver segments of the PAM half day course. This will be done in a really supported peer environment where you'll be able to get formative feedback from both myself and my co-facilitator where we'll kind of look at the, the training skills that you're developing and also the content of the course and the ways in which you're, you're getting that material across um, to your participant group. The participants on day two will be peer trainers like yourself, so it will be a kind of a friendly audience to, to develop those skills with. We find it quite a fun and enjoyable experience and we find that all our peer trainers develop their own resources and share new ideas about how to get across what the patient activation measure is and how to help people to learn to use it accurately in a, in a range of health and social care settings. Of course, after that two days, you might still need a little bit more time to hone your skills and develop your materials before your first outing as, as a fully fledged trainer. So we do offer ongoing mentoring and support. We offer follow up workshops and often there's an opportunity to co-facilitate with one of our peak health coaches um, as you kind of progress your, your training delivery. So I hope that's given you a little bit of insight into the course and we really do look forward to meeting you soon on one of our courses. Thanks for listening.